Hello everyone, welcome back to Dark Cloud. Template temper template. Temporarily forgot what I was gonna say. Jesus. Uh and as you can see, the next territory, number 17, as I said last time, is the final one. It's where the boss of this area is. Now we can't go fight him right away because obviously we haven't completed the village, and well, there's no way to get up there. So let's just leave the dungeon. And head back into Matataki Village and finish its rebuilding. Now, I don't remember this one as rel well ugh, Oh man, I cannot English today. I don't remember this one as well as I do uh, No Rune, but it still shouldn't be as, uh, that bad. That being said, uh, I'm just going to place down a building, repair it to what I can, with everything... And then I'll move it to where they want it to be. So let's go talk to pa Pal. You don't seem you don't seem to be from around here. Well, if you're new here, you should go to Treant. Let's go see Treant first. I'd like to be near the peanut pond, where I can s sleep well after a dip in the water there. Eh? You want to know where that is? Look at my Lataki Village, real close. You should see, it should be really easy to spot. You're already next to it, technically. And what else do you need? I start to feel restless when I don't have my laundry hung on the clothesline. Could you do something about that? Sure could. So she wants to be next to this pond. Or he, I can't tell. Could be either. Could be either. I'm going to remove this as soon as I find it. There we go. I'll put her or him. Don't know. Don't know. Could be either. And there you go. So that one's finished. Uh, I don't know what these two are. Kai and Momo. Uh, stairs, storage. Um, too far. Uh, Kai. And Momo. Now I just need to find them. Chests, chests everywhere. God damn it. Chests, chests everywhere. Let's go inside, see if they're inside. Hey. Job well done. So how's your wife lately? Is she doing all right? Oh, you're not married? Oh, okay, okay, I got you. I know that sometimes you wish you were, you were though, huh? Kai, you're weird. Requests? Oh, I'll make a request. This song, Memories at the Bar. It's a classic. Memories, see you at the bar. Okay, he's obviously insane. The torch keeps the evil spirits away, so don't forget the torch. Put at least two of them. T two of them? Jesus, man. I think that's called paranoia. So yeah, I think uh, I'm going to build all the houses and then collect everything from them. So where is Momo? Because that, that person's clearly the insane one. Up oh, there. That's not Momo. That's a fucking music person. These stairs, why are they so difficult? Was, is there, oh, there is more room. It's back here. Ah, oh, there she is. Oh, this is the first time I've seen you. This is the first time I've seen you. Where do you come from? Hmm, from New Rune Village. Uh, sorry, I've never heard of it. I'm Momo, nice to meet you. Hmm, I like the shop. So I'd like the house to be next, to, uh, close to Mr. Mustache's store. Don't forget a nameplate in front of the house. Alrighty. Oof, 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 oof. This this house is a nightmare to traverse. So she wants to be near the shop. So I'll move this over here. Guess that'll do. And a 
torch and the sign, because they all require that. Okay, next is Kosius' house. I think he wants to be a pie, I don't remember. I know one of them wants to be a pie, or two of them, technically. And Kosius. And let's go inside, if I can find the door, Jesus. I'm bad at doors, guys. Don't know how they work. Hi, who are you? Oh, I see. I'm Kosius. Nice to meet you, Link. I can't get out of it. I can't go out of this house. So come and visit me once in a while. Me? I just like high places, that's all. Even though I can't leave this house. It'd be cool if grass were growing on top of the shell. Of my shell. So all he wants is some fat grass. There you go. He's the only person that wants grass. Gob's house. I don't remember where he wants to be. Uh, torch. Sign. I'm running out of signs. I only have one left, and that's for the next house. And Gob. Oh, what the hell? That's weird. Oh! You're not from this village. I don't know who you are, but that's okay. I'm Gob, the vagabond cook. Remember that. Good, good thing you asked. I'd very much like to have my house close to Momo's. That's not creepy. My house is a, is sig, a sig, a, my house signature is a cool design comb, combing bones and trees. Keep that in mind, will you? Okay, so first off, she wants to be near Momo because he's a fucking stalking creeper. I don't think I should allow that, but I don't think I have much of a choice. So that way, configure that. And tree. Mushroom house. I think this is the other one that wants to be up high. In fact, I'm pretty sure it is. So let me place down Earth A. Um, if I can find a spot for it, jeez. Uh, uh, hmm. Hmm, this is a problem. I hate this area because it's so hard to build things anywhere. Yeah, I have to build it over here. Which means I need to move this house. It has to be on this side of the lake. No if and or buts about it. So I could just move this guy's house to some other place. And then maybe it wouldn't be so bad. Ugh. In uh, management. I guess it doesn't matter because there's like no place to put a building over here. Jesus. Trees. God damn, why is it so hard to put a tree there? There, surrounded by trees. And high spot. And. Why does it feel like I still have a lot of building supplies? Uh, because each of these things requires, like, a ton of things. Oof, these take forever to build. But they all have a lot of good items, like, uh, gourds and fruits of Eden, stuff like that. So, let me just... 
fill all these in really quick. And torch. Torch, torch, watermill, watermill. And let's go over to the house and see what they want. It is night of the 14th day. This is going to take long at all. Huh? You're not from around here. Where are you from? I'd like a good view. Ask my wife for the rest. I like seeing a view from the balcony of our mushroom house. Could you take care of that? Oh, I haven't seen you around here. Let's see. I'd like a high place where the view is good and where it's breezy. We need a second floor. We stored things there. We have so many things we need for, to find room for. Alright. Select, select, select. So first things first. Um, that's not what I wanted to move. Ugh. I'm gonna move Kosius' house over to... Uh, Earth A because I think they want Earth B because it's higher. Whoop. So let's place down Earth B. And then move it on top of Earth B. And then add the things that they asked for. That and that. All right, and now I'm gonna put some wells around. Just gonna put all the wells over here because I don't think any of them want to be next to wells. And then I'm gonna put water mills over here, I guess. And I think that's everything except for decoration, which I will do later. So first, let's collect all... Um, actually, first, I'm going to go through all the events. And then after that, we'll go treasure hunting. And uh, I'll speed it up and play some music in the background when I go treasure hunting. But before then, let's... let's uh, let us... Explore these houses. And see what they have to say for us. So let's go to PAL first. Hey, there you are. Come sit here. Finally, I can settle down. I hear we owe you. I I hear we owe it to you. Stay for me. I'll cook you something special. Hmm, I'm full. So, have you found the Moon People's village yet? I see. Wise Owl's forest is really big, so there's n it, so it may not be that easy to find. Oh well, don't get discouraged. Take take it easy and don't rush. Cheer up, I'll give you this. Ooh, a fruit of Eden. Very good. Good luck. Bye. That was kind of nice. Now let's go to Kosius' place. You have a tree growing out of your head, bro. Want some candy? I'll take that. Here. Uh, you don't have you don't like half-eaten food? Oh, okay then. This one's a special treat. Just pull it out of my ass. Here. Candy. And by the way, if you ever get overloaded with items, come to me. I can hold a lot under under my fluffy grass ass. See ya. I can hide all sorts of shit under my fluffy grass ass. <laughs> uh, 
Oh god, it's so hard to. Oh, I I, I triggered Momo's house. Grandpa, what are you doing up there? Come down. No, I won't. Why not? Don't you see? The evil cloud is is about to veil the world. Stop talking nonsense and come down here. Momo, pray with me for a world peace. Oh, come on. Are you nuts? Gah. Call on your own grandpa nuts. What a granddaughter. Can it be... Can... Can it be that you, Momo? That your brain is already infected by evil? Oh, boy. He really has gone nuts. Link, you're the only one that... Link, so you're the one that restored that our house, right? Thank you. Here, here's something I found for you. A plant buster. C cool. It'll serve you well on your journey. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? <laughs> okay. Fucking kooky old man. I knew it was fucking crazy. Oh, where's the other place? There it is. Dobbs house. Whoop. Crocodile Dundee. Ah, there you are. Thanks to you, my house... My house that I'm so proud of is restored. Today, I will treat you with a real men's cooking. It's a rare seafood dish. What, you're full already? I still have a lot more. What, you're already done, huh? You can't grow big and tall unless you eat. Hey, just a minute. Ta-da! It's a gift. Take it, okay? Frozen tuna. <laughs> it's a bit big for takeout, eh? Seafood's hard to come by here. Enjoy. Alright. So next should be... Be Bunku's house. If I can get in the house. There we go. Hey, I'm in the middle of something. Could you come up here for a second? Kululu, don't climb up there. It's dangerous. Come on down. I'm sorry, I didn't know it was something you were saving for later. I know I ate it, but there's nothing we can do about that now. <sighs> wow, this is really bad. Hey Link, I ate something at Kululu's. She got really mad at me and climbed all the way up there. It was a strange looking thing and I carelessly ate it. You don't happen to have one, do you? It was coiled like a shell, uh, and white in color. Oh, and it was really sweet. And ta-da, we just happened to have one. Ah, that's it. Gulu, look at this. I'll give this to you if you come down. Here. Gee, thanks. Let me return the favor. Sorry, we don't have much, but... I can give you this. We don't have much we can give, but please take this anyway. Ointment leaf. They say in the east you can make all a cure-all from this leaf. Seems you're traveling, so this may come in handy. May indeed. All right, next is old people. I think this is the actual final one. Hey you, this way, come on. Come on up here. 
There, you can climb that ladder. What do you think? The view from here is great, isn't it? Great view from here is great, isn't it? Oh, my voice. Still not doing too good from the last time I did voicing. I'm so happy that our house is restored. I owe all this to you. Really, thank you so much. Fucking Smurfs. Now I need to return the favor. Let's see. Hmm. Right, that's it. I have just a thing. Honey, what's keeping you? Mm. Where did I put it? Ah! Ah! I found it! Oh! Ah! 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 Oof. She's just smiling like he's fucking dead. Ouch! Mmm. Hair. It is. Moongrass seed. I found it walking in the woods looking for giant mushrooms. It never grows whenever I plant it. Trent said it'd be, it'll be something very good someday, but it only grows in a special place in the woods. Since you seem to be getting into the woods a lot, you might be able to find that special place. Good luck to you. Bye. Whew. Okay, I think that's everything. And apparently someone is still unhappy. So I'm gonna speed up here, collect all the chests, and figure out who the hell is unhappy with me. So I'll see you guys, well, in a little bit.
All right, we completed all the requests. Also, I'm back. I still have a little bit collection I need to do, but it's almost done. Now. Yeah, <sighs> yeah. Thank you. Thanks to you, we have a gentle breeze blowing in Matataki village. I am grateful to you. Take this little one. Uh, uh, achoo. Power powder. It's my way of saying thank you. An extraordinary item. It upgrades what it is. An extraordinary item it is. Upgrades weapons unconditionally. Make the best of it, darling. Hey, Trian. Link gets a ward and I get nothing? That's not fair. <laughs> so you've noticed. Dormani seems to have gotten his fire back. I'm glad. Here you go, little Dormani. Take this. Uh, uh, achoo! Battle axe. Mm, much nicer. Dormani's dad, Fu Fuda, Fudo, used this, used to own this. Take good care of it. This is about it. This is about all I can do for you. The rest of it, you have to do on your own, somehow. Make sure you're prepared. Alright, and there's a few things in here. Or just the one, I think, maybe. Oh, nope, there's one here, too. Alright. A little longer. So, as you saw, I moved that house down to here because I need to surround this with water. Uh, I've done all of that house. Yeah, I've collected everything from every house now. So, now that the collection is done, whew, time to upgrade all of my units, or all of my characters, basically. So, first things first, I'm going to put in, uh, first I need to take out a few things. So yeah, we have a lot of items, like a lot. Okay, I think that's everything now. So, I'm not going to use all of these, but we have, well first off we have a fluffy donut, which increases uh, Link's defense. By six. We have fish candy, which upgrades Haro's defense by five. And Darmani's grass cake, which increases his defense by six. So Link has the highest defense, so he needs the least amount of HP. So let's distribute these uh, seven fruits of Eden. So I'm gonna get everyone to a hundred, but I think. Whoops, that's not what I meant to do. And I get Haro to 100. I'm gonna get everyone to 110 and save the other two for later. For the next er uh, next hero. And I'm gonna give each person one gourd. So, everyone's going to have seven, I think, now. Uh, no, Darmani only has six, but that's fine. Darmani will be used the least, most likely. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna put the other four upgrade items away. Like so. And then I'm gonna withdraw anything that I want to sell. Or just repair powder. Uh, I should put my level up powder away. Because I won't be using it. And I think that's all I really need to put away. I want to withdraw all of this repair powder, if I can. I know I picked up a lot of items. Okay, I can, that's good. 
and that should be all I need. I also have a ton of attachments now, as you can tell. Uh, so I'm just gonna leave it at that. I'll organize that later. Um, let's see, what else is there? So, I think that's everything. Pretty sure I've gathered up all the items. Uh, and we're ready to go fight the boss of the Wise Owl Forest. But we'll be doing that next time. Uh, yeah, I think that's everything. I think we actually were able to do everything. So, uh, next time... We'll go into the Wise Owl Forest and take on the Guardian. See you all then.